The NCAA tournament started in 1939 after Ohio State coach Harold Olson presented the idea to the National Association of Basketball Coaches. The first tournament included just eight teams. Four played in San Francisco and four in Philadelphia, with the championship game being held in Evanston, Illinois. Oregon beat Ohio State to win the first NCAA championship. The NCAA moved the tournament to Kansas City for the next three years. After that, the NCAA moved the tournament to New York City, where it challenged the more prestigious National Invitation Tournament. Oklahoma State became the first repeat champion, winning the NCAA tournament in 1945 and 1946. In those early years, schools could play in both the NCAA and the NIT. In 1950, CCNY won the NCAA and the NIT, beating Bradley in the championship game of both tournaments. Eventually, the NCAA took on more prominence than the NIT. In 1964, UCLA won its first national title under coach John Wooden. That started UCLA's run of 10 championships in a 12-year span. In 1966, Texas Western, now known as the University of Texas El Paso, became the first national champion with an all-black starting five. The Miners defeated Adolph Rupp's Kentucky Wildcats in the finals. In 1971, the tournament's semifinals and finals were played in a dome stadium for the first time. UCLA beat Villanova for the championship that year at the Astrodome in Houston, Texas. In 1976, Indiana beat Big Ten rival Michigan for the national title, the last undefeated team to win the NCAA championship. In 1979, Indiana State, led by Larry Bird, faced Michigan State and Spartan star Irvin Magic Johnson in the championship game. The matchup drew incredible television ratings as Michigan State beat Bird's Indiana State team. In 1982, the Final Four returned to a dome stadium as North Carolina beat Georgetown at the Louisiana Superdome. The tournament expanded to 64 teams in 1985. In 1996, Kentucky beat Syracuse at the Continental Airlines Arena, or the Meadowlands. That was the last time a Final Four was held in a basketball arena. In 2003, Syracuse freshman Carmelo Anthony became the first so-called one-and-done player to lead his team to an NCAA title. In 2011, the tournament expanded to 68 teams, necessitating the first four in Dayton, Ohio. In 2013, Rick Pitino led Louisville to the national championship and became the first coach to win an NCAA title at two different schools. He had been the coach at Kentucky in 1996.